Hello and welcome to Musto Invest in Cambodia. In this video today, I'll be answering some questions that I got from one of my subscribers. Any questions about Cambodia that I haven't answered, please don't hesitate to contact us and comment below if you need any assistance to Cambodia, you need any legal work with over 10 years of experience in living in Cambodia. I am very happy to help anyone out there and Muslim Invest in Cambodia will continue to provide the best service for any traveler and investor to the Kingdom of Wanda, Cambodia. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to our channel and hit the notification button, like and share the video to everyone and let's get started. So the clothing business in Cambodia and what do I think about opening a business in Cambodia? Definitely the clothing business is something that you can also try to do. If you should focus on the online store because it's very popular in Cambodia. However, in Cambodia there are also many factories. It would be also great if you can import any clothes from Cambodia to your country and you can sell them in any other country. If you need that, actually Must Invest in Cambodia has a partnership with a local Cambodian garment factory. So if you need any clothes, we can assist you and we can help you to export to any country around the world. So yes. Before you want to start a business in Cambodia, you need to register and the process will take a few weeks. Once you register your company, you can then finally start doing business. And some businesses that I do recommend, if you're an investor or you're someone that needs to get started in Cambodia, it depends on your budget and your experience. Right now in Cambodia, there is a demand on pharmaceutical and health products as you know with this pandemic people they want to protect themselves they want to focus on their health so I think health products are the number one business that you can do in Cambodia and the second business that I think you should try if you want to invest in Cambodia is the food delivery business because I think that nowadays more and more people they want to go out and they want to have fun so opening a restaurant might be a good idea and in fact there is a video in the link below that I used to make a couple of weeks ago so check it out if you haven't checked it out and I think if you open a restaurant you should also make a delivery service because we don't know what can happen in case quarantine or downs will happen again you can then deliver the food you can make a delivery service for your customer and number three is import export business yes you can bring any products to Cambodia and you can sell them in the market or in a shop but focus more on the online aspect because the online service has really increased in Cambodia so I think import export business is very good to Cambodia and in the link below you can check the video that I used to make about the best products to import or export to Cambodia and yes if you can open a school doesn't matter if it's a music school if it's a conventional school any school that you can teach local people I think it's great and even though it's a challenging business it's not easy to do i think if you have a new skill and you want to teach the local people you can definitely succeed and if you want to send your child to school studying in cambodia the school fee is anything from 1000 to 3000 us dollars per month that's the average price if you want to send your kid to study in cambodia for one year because yes we have many international schools and the level varies but yes we have Belty International School we have West International School we have Anya Sastan International School these are the big schools in Cambodia where you can send your child to study so it depends some schools they have a full day English program so like New Gateway International School they have also in Chinese and in Khmer so it depends but definitely if you want to open a school it's a great opportunity and logistics transportation this is 
what Cambodia really needs because there aren't an enough buses, enough transportation. So if you can make a logistics company, if you can make a transportation company, that would be great in Cambodia because of the potential that still there is as Cambodia is still growing. And farming agriculture, if you buy or rent land in Cambodia and you grow crops, I think it's great because agriculture in Cambodia is still not so developed compared to Thailand and Vietnam. So these are businesses that I think you could start if you come to Cambodia. But actually I used to make a few videos about the best businesses that you can start in Cambodia. So do check the links below for videos that I used to make and feel free to contact me for additional questions about Cambodia or any content that you wish for me to create for you. So thank you so much and I'll see you next time.